Welcome to Good Mythical More. Do you know what the ex very specific parts of <laughs> utensils are? Very specific we, parts. We are going to school you on that. And then we're gonna eat some cram Blu-ray. <laughs> <laughs> That's my favorite thing I've ever said. But I'll, we're also going to check our voicemail. Did you know yep. there are wild camels in Arizona? Wild, wild camels? camels? In Arizona? There's also some oceanfront property there I'd like to sell you. <laughs> that sounds like something I'd like to go on the hunt for. Not like Chef actual Josh. hunt, but just like look Come for on it. in here. It's been a while since we've had you on a moor, man. Yeah, it's been fun. What are we eating yeah. today? Um, we're eating placards of Ooh. utensils. Get, get right there in the middle, you know? Get closer to red. I'm gonna look in that screen. Oh, a little bit, a little bit more. Hey, Josh. A little bit more. Hey, you, you want me to keep? You go, okay. I want you to be right. Well, to be our, our, the mic. We're not touching, but I can feel our leg hairs kind of velcroing together. <laughs> that's, you know, that's why I've got on jeans. No, me and me and Rhett. Well, he's got oh, just, just at the ankle. I can, I can uh, feel, I feel our leg the fuzzies. Hairs. You know, I can feel our leg hairs. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah you're wearing, I actually, we're both wearing like deep above the knee shorts today. Yeah. yeah. We've yeah, been like matching outfits, flip flops, and shorts. Yeah. We're we're here now. My my the shirt shorts, is so, the my shirt situation is so, around here. My shirt is so big. <laughs> it looks like a it looks like I've got on a night shirt. I used to I used to sleep in a you pull these up. When you say I used to, is that you mean like in the I used to sleep in a night shirt like last, a up until last year? If just underwear and a big shirt, just like this. I would sleep in a shirt like this. And it had Ernest on it. Yeah, that's called T shirt and your panties on. Which which uh, which Ernest? No. Like which movie? Um, like Ernest Scared Stupid Ernest? Before the movies existed. Oh, just... Uh, he was... And his name wasn't... Name. He, Jim Varney. Jim Varney. Jim Varney. Pine State he, Milk. He, he, uh. he did ads for Pine State Milk in North Carolina. And he was a local celebrity. And I had a t-shirt my grandma gave me, my nanny gave me. And I, they, they said, I got you a new night shirt. And it was... They, the shirts would be just this big. <laughs> and I would just have on whitey tighties. In a big freaking shirt, and that's what I was sleeping every night. Are you still rocking the whitey tighties? Uh, no. Okay, <laughs> just wondering. I've thought about going back to whitey tighties because I haven't worn oh. them since I was a kid. What are you wearing these days? Uh, uh, so they started making these boxer briefs that kind of are elastic material, so it makes me feel athletic with everything I do. You talking about me undies? No, they're not me undies. Those oh, are. Well, well, you should, you should you gotta get on it. You should get. We we have lots of those rolling around here. It's a Hanes X Comfort. Okay. Well, we, <laughs> so got X Factor we for gotta get, undercarriage. We got to get consistent on our brand. On our brand <laughs> That's what I'm matching up. I recommend wearing a night shirt. You know, yeah. if you're a if you're a sexy girlfriend, that that's the cool thing to do. Yeah, that's I. A sexy girlfriend. I wear my girlfriend's button downs you, actually. But you, hold on, so you got to be somebody's girlfriend. You can't just be a sexy girl. What about a sexy single girl that just wants to be in a night shirt? Or what about a sexy single boy? Huh? Uh, no, you have to be a uh, <laughs> sexy girlfriend. Okay, and you're wearing your partner's shirt? Is that what makes it sexy? Yeah, 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 yeah. And it's way too big? Way too big. Because he's so much bigger than you? Yeah. God, this is making me uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> I'm comfortable as I've ever been. Yeah, Josh has to sit between about. the two of you as you <laughs> talk about this weird scenario. When I was little and, and my nanny would give me a nightshirt, she'd say, here, you can look like a sexy little girlfriend. <laughs> That's how I know. How wow. Oh. I thought we were going to talk about Jim Varney more. <laughs> I'm mean? a huge Jim Varney guy. Know what I mean, Vern? Oh, the Beverly did, Hillbillies reboot, he was did, great. When did oh, he, really? Did, 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 did he say, dead, know right? what I mean, Vern, um, in the movies? Of course he did. Because that's what he said in the commercials. Know what I mean, Vern? Know what I mean, Vern? He was yeah. talking to Vern. I'm not familiar with the local North Carolina uh, commercials. He, 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 <laughs> he, he, Jim Varney's been dead since the 90s, right? Jim Varney, yeah. Oh, uh, I don't know when he died. All right, Jim so Varney's dead? There are different parts to this spoon. What a way to find out. Yeah. He, Jim Varney was also, I mean, I, I, I'm giving the deep references. No one has any answers. Do we know what the Michael, I'm looking at you, Morgan, because I think you would know. I don't know why you don't know. He died in 2000. Not Jim Varney, but uh, Michael Knight. So he almost Devin. He made it to the millennium. What was the guy's name? What was the guy's name who drove the rig and picked up Michael Knight and Kit in Knight Rider? You're too young for yeah, this. Yeah, that's a pass. That's a pass uh, for me. That's it it pass. might be Devin. I don't know. 
Div um, or Devon. All right, so what's A on this spoon? The tip. Oh, okay. The tip. Yeah, so um, to orient everyone a little bit, so each each utensil has its own little parts, and each part has a specific name. So you guys are going to try and guess each little part of each utensil, and then I have the answers. So we're saying um, A as to what it actually is, is the tip. Yeah, I'm going we're with tip. It's tip the, called the corona. It's Latin for crown. Oh, that is not a coronavirus reference. That is that's the it's a okay. Hold it's on. an it's obscure right. sexual reference. Is what it is. What? Wait, hold on. Chase has some information. Devin, Ma yes, his name was Devin. Well, you ruined Chase's information because that's what it was. Devin. What? Oh, this is called a Devin. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> what are the chances? No, that was the answer that you just got about the Night Rider uh, yeah, question. Yeah, 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 yeah. If that was called a Devin two. I, my mind, my brain would explode. That yeah. would be three Devons. Yeah, that's cr be crazy. So Rhett and I said tip. What is a? So it's a it's a type of tip. It's blank spoon tip. tip. Bill spoon tip. tip. Blunt tip. This is a horn bill gave, spoon she, tip. She gave us the answer already, guys. A bowl tip. Oh, it's a bowl tip. A bowl tip. It's a bowl tip. And then so B is bowl. That's the, correct. The, this is the bowl. Yeah, B is definitely the bowl. Okay, C. C is the bowl back. I'd say the bowl butt. That's a bull butt. If I There's ever no bull. One. There's no bull um, in C. It's the attack. What, what's Latin for attachment? Vivictism. You know when you're going skiing and you go into one of those ski bowls and you're right on the lip of it? What's that called? The the lip. The bowl lip. The lip. Yeah. Lip. It, no, I think it has to do with like it's the it's where it's like, it fastens. The this abutment. Is, it's like the abutment. The abutment bridge. The bridge. It has something to do with what physically happens in that spot. Yeah, not, not the, being attached, but the terminus. <laughs> what happens in that spot? It goes. It goes mouth eat. down. The the downer. The slope. The oh ooh. That's pretty good. It's drop. The drop. The drop. drop? The drop. It, uh, do all spoons have drops? Yeah, but you need to be able to. Yeah, uh, but okay. you just said the drop on this spoon is very aggressive. I, I, I need a more shallow drop. Yeah. Actually, this makes a lot more sense because we're looking at a spoon that was like two pieces welded together, where most modern spoons are just one piece of continuous. This is, this yeah, is an ornate, antiquated so, spoon. So I don't even know you why we, this spoon? why we would even. Think I would never that use this spoon. Yeah. When Christy and I um, were were working on our wedding registry. Um, the only thing that I really weighed in on, to your surprise, I'm sure, yeah. was, um, meaning I didn't weigh in on everything, Right. was um, the, the tableware, and especially the spoons. And for our entire marriage, we have the same silverware. You have the same silverware? I think, we've, I think I've asked you this before. I think you've switched up your silverware. We have the same silverware that we've had our entire marriage. Silverware, am I saying that right? Tableware. Are you okay? Uh, I'm a winner. Why I, the yes, spoon? Winner in a night shirt. <laughs> what find, about the spoons? I find it interesting that you did that. Spoons when you were first, my favorite. First got married the at smaller like 21. Because I ate everything with a spoon, and I wanted the spoon to be exactly how I wanted. I would have opinions mm -hmm. about that now. As a matter of fact, we recently uh, augmented our silverware collection, and uh, someone other than a family member bought. The silverware for us in a pinch. Oh gosh! And uh, this part, which we'll find out soon, what this is, <clears throat> instead of being flat, it actually is taller and narrow. Like it goes the opposite way, and it's just like I, 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 I you hate I, it. I don't use any of them, and I'm like, what, what? Why did they make this decision? Why did the designer make this decision to make it? Turn this sideways. Never, never trust, never trust anyone else to, uh, to to pick out your tableware, your silverware. All right, so D, D is the hinge, it's the pre-drop. This Pass. is um a the name of this is a, a body part. The knee. I think it's more of an elbow because you use spoons with your arms. Elbow, elbow. Okay, look at the spoon, and the, the bowl of the spoon is the head. The knuckle, the neck. Neck. Clothes. Throat. Collar. Spoon throat. Esophagus. The sternum. Shoulders. 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 
See that? Spoons ain't got no shoulders. That should be called the neck. That was a missed opportunity. Who who decided that these are the names? Why can't it be us? Yeah, it should be because we would call that the neck for sure. That's the neck of a spoon. And I would have go back. I'd call this the head. That's what this should be. Is I call we're... this the torso and this the foot. I'm gonna just make it all a person. Yeah, guys, we have other placards besides this. Oh, one. oh really? Yeah. Let's yeah. speed this up. <laughs> I'm kind of bored with the spoon. Okay. This, e? this is the arm. If, when, e, if E's not called the shaft, I don't know what the shaft is. <laughs> that should be the shaft. That is a shaft of a spoon. This yeah. word relates to a flower. The petal. Stem. Stem. Hmm. The petal. Was. The flower like, shaft. Not the petal. And then... The handle? Yep. Okay. And the butt. This relates the, to an airport. The terminus. The terminal. Terminal, yeah. The huh. terminal. Okay. <laughs> we got through that one quick. Let's move on to a different, <laughs> a different utensils. A fork. Okay. Well, I know that A is. You knew me to point Those at are like the tines, right? Those are the tines. But look. No, no, it's pointing at the. B is the tine. No, no. B is the. C is the tine. C is the tine. A is pointing at the space in between. The, the space is not part of the fork. That's just like air. Right. Yeah. You know, a is for air. Yeah, that's a trick. We don't name that part of our forks. <laughs> it's. Okay, it has to do... Like, what's the, the space between your fingers called? <laughs> nothing, it's yeah, nothing. Yeah, yeah. It's not yeah. part of you. You don't yeah. own it's it. It's called not finger. Yeah. Um, yeah. It has to do with a casino. The slots? Yeah. All right, mm. and then B is the pointy yep. pieces. Point? It's just the point. point? Yep. Okay, the tines. C is the tine. And then the D is Paint. the... That's the Grundel. I use Grundel. Okay. Uh, <laughs> D is the tine... Uh, the, 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 the tine... Marriage. The Tyne base. Tyne Lord. <laughs> it has to do with a tree. The trunk. The root. The root. It's the root. Okay, and then E is the shoulders. Shoulders. No, but okay. you go neck. back to what your spoon. Neck? Neck. The ball. It is ball. the neck. Come now on. it's the neck. So we got first four people and spoon people and they didn't get together? But Okay, so what is F? Because F is like a spoon. The That's the on, drop. The drop. Well, I think since we're- How can I not be the drop? It's, it's reversed, it's the rise. Oh, This is the drop, Josh. this is the rise. You gotta go opposite way. F is, it. it it's just back, which is confusing. All right. Wait, they oh, did the, the fork namers and the spoon namers are independent. They're different yeah, people. Yeah, yeah. They're different committees. Which I think makes life more interesting. Who benefits from this? <laughs> you know, like what, like what do they get from calling all these shots? Is Jesus the handle? Yeah. Uh, is Jesus the? Where's handle? the terminal? Of the Jesus fork? take the handle. If a spoon has a terminal, the fork must have a terminal. No, forks forks go on just, into <laughs> infinity. I bet, I, yeah. If they're oh, defining look. the spaces between it. Dang, now we're really. Hey, well, what's the space in between the tongs? I mean. <laughs> You know, yeah. the thing you're tonging. A is the... It's just, I think it's just called tongable space. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. And all, all spaces space are tongable. tongable. <laughs> Technically, if you're really thinking about it, you can tong anything. <laughs> oh, tongable space. Let's see. So, A is it's the, the teeth. Starboard. Yeah. Oh, it is the teeth. Oh, wow. really? Dang, I got Man. it right. B, B Josh, and D and C look like they... B Josh and D and C wants to name B. I want to name B? Yes, you've previously said this yeah, word yeah, yeah, yeah. enthusiastically. Yeah. It, shaft? In, yeah. In B's the shaft. B and D, there's We got two the shafts. shaft. But you got you have to say it like, one yeah. port shaft. Port shaft and one starboard shaft. Yeah, right. Yeah. That's how no. things work. Okay, B, C, and D all have shaft, but there's different uh, you know, qualifiers. Well, D's the bottom shaft. The four shaft. <laughs> the uh, background shaft. C is the back shaft. Back shaft. Top shaft, back shaft. Top. Mid shaft. Yeah, it was the, the, the lower Elevator shaft. Elevator shaft. The longer the tongs, the, the, more, the more shaft shafts. segments they have. Yeah. That's it's what they the say. Inner shaft and outer shaft. Inner and outer mm. shaft. Man, I'm, I'm, I'm really. Look at that. The, the, the spacing the of this is pretty great. Interior shaftoid. That's right. what I call it. It's, an, it's a kitchen term. Is all space shaftable? I think so. You shouldn't shaft all space. When you're like, can you? When you're like 13, 14, <laughs> definitely. Oh, we got another one. Oh! Couch cushions. Oh, what, what is, is this? <laughs> all space is shaftable. Well, one, E's a corkscrew. So this is easy. Nope. 
a wine swizzle opener. stick. <laughs> you want to start at E? Duck penis. Sh- they do duck penis. They yeah, like explode, we know. right? Oh yeah, we know. Oh, man, explode. Don't they explode? Know. Did I make that up? The duck peni uh, explode? Only, I didn't mean yeah, to bring you, it up. You only mate once. Here. Yeah. yeah. Right? Yeah, it's just sacrificial. That's how we should be. This message will self-destruct in five, four. Um, you want to touch that? Not that we called a it a A's a bottle pen. opener. <laughs> no, B's a bottle opener. What does A do? Because I've never known, to be fair. I don't know what any of these oh, things do. Oh, I know do. what. A, a is the thing that you, that you put on the edge of the wine glass. A wine and key. You, a key. No, it's it's a fulcrum. It's a lever. Okay, it's a lever. Yeah. What it, it's called a blank lever. A bottle lever. No, it's a, a piece of clothing. Blouse lever. Sh- sh- chemise that you lever. wear on your feet. Night shoe sh- leather. Night shirt. shoe lever. No. Sandal lever. No. Thong lever. Jordan. Jorts. Jelly. Jort lever. lever. <laughs> what part of your body do you wear? It. Crocs leather. Boot lever. lever. Boot leather. It's called boot, boot leather. That makes boot sense. Lever. Boot lever. Lever. Yep. Okay. Boot. Does it kind of looks like a boot. B is 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 pretty straightforward. Just an opener. In name. A what? Bottle opener. It's just the opener. Crank. Yeah. Bottle cap remover. Bottle cap remover. Too long. C. What is that? I can't tell. We don't have that on ours. The same. Oh, I know what that is. It's a can opener. No. On ours, it's a little saw. What are you sawing with that? Wow. What could you saw with that? Like a I piece believe of cheese? this is, yeah, this is for cheese. It's like a single cheese cube. Well, if it's a wine opener, they gotta have a little cheese knife. Uh, I think this is for cutting. Sometimes the uh, yep. the top foil. of the foil is, is really, really yep. difficult to get through. So this is a foil foil knife. Foil cutter, yeah. Foil cutter. It's not wet, but can you cut cheese with it? Yeah, sure. And then D is? Just a handle. Yep, handle. And then E is we we E's, never got E. E is it, it, it has an interesting name. It's the name of an insect. Mantis, mantis toboggan. Uh, what insect has a um? What in the world? I don't understand. Caterpillar, it. horsefly, tongue, butterfly. Close. Uh, who was who was close? Josh was close with caterpillar. Caterpillar, butterfly. Centipede. Twisted Met- metamorphosis. Worm. The worm. C- cocoon. Worm. Yeah, worm. The worm. worm. The worm. Who comes up with these I'm things? Not, well, that's pretty easy. I mean, it kind of looks like a worm. I think we're gonna... Um, Should have called it the duck penis. I think I'm gonna be be talking about this worm. That's it, right, Jake? If you no at your next party, just take out a fork, a spoon, a, a, a Somebody wine get, opener, and be like, hey, you know the parts of the spoon? Or just like, somebody give me the worm. You know, it's like, just call it the worm. And then you look over and Devin's doing the worm in the middle of the party. You don't want that. I do want that. Oh, you want that, Devin. Look and feel your mythical best with our grooming collection, available at mythical.com.